When everything feels off and you're mad and it's just not comfy, that's what we call stress. It's like a storm inside you, making things all uneasy. Let's talk about this feeling and figure out how to deal with it. Let me share a little story with you that might just help us navigate the waves of anxiety together. Once upon a time, in a quaint village nestled between rolling hills and babbling brooks, there lived a young woman named Lily. Lily was known for her vibrant spirit and radiant smile, but lately, a shadow of anxiety had cast itself over her. One day, as she wandered through the village, she heard whispers of a mystical place called the Garden of Tranquility. Legend had it that within its enchanted boundaries, one could find the key to unlocking inner peace and releasing the burdens of anxiety, determined to ease the restlessness within her. Lily embarked on a journey to discover the elusive garden. The path was winding and adorned with challenges, symbolic of the twists and turns of life that often led to anxiety. After days of travel, Lily arrived at the entrance of the Garden of Tranquility. A wise old gardener welcomed her and explained that the key to releasing anxiety lay in tending to the garden within one's heart. The garden was divided into sections, each representing different aspects of Lily's life. There were patches of self-doubt, overthinking, and fear. In the center stood a magnificent tree, symbolizing her core strength. Lily started working diligently, pulling out weeds of negativity and watering the flowers of positivity. As she nurtured the garden, she found solace in the rhythmic flow of her actions. The more she connected with the earth beneath her fingers, the lighter her heart became. Along her journey, Lily encountered various creatures, each representing a facet of her anxiety. There was a jittery rabbit symbolizing restlessness and a cautious turtle embodying fear of the unknown. Lily realized that acknowledging and befriending these creatures instead of fighting them aloud, her to gain control as she tended to the garden. Lily learned to embrace the ebb and flow of life just as seasons changed. She discovered the power of mindfulness, the art of being present in the moment. The once overwhelming anxieties began to dissipate like morning mist under the warm rays of the sun. After weeks of dedicated care, Lily's garden of tranquility blossomed into a haven of serenity. The once clouded sky above her heart cleared, revealing the radiant blue beyond. Returning to the village, Lily shared her story, inspiring others to embark on their own journeys within. The Garden of Tranquility became a symbol of hope, teaching everyone that true peace begins by cultivating a garden of serenity within oneself. Way to beat, my friend. Listen to this lesson, acknowledge your fears and restlessness as this story gently suggests. Befriend them instead of fighting. It's like gardening your inner world. As this narrative unfolded, it nudged us to see our minds like a garden. Some parts might be weedy with self-doubt, others blooming with positivity. It's a reminder to tend to our mental garden patiently in this quiet pause. Let's grasp the core idea, our hearts, like Lily's garden, can bloom with serenity as this story ends. It encourages us to start our journey within. Cultivating a peaceful haven in the garden of our hearts, our little tale, it reminds us that, so, as we wrap up, let's remember that we're not alone in this journey. Take a deep breath, embrace the moment, and let's face the world with a newfound sense of peace, be happy and live in the present. My friend, see you again soon.